So today is my birthday. I'm turning 19 and I just feel that I need to address something and put a stop to it so that I won't have to deal with it any other day after this. False stories were passed around about me. Things, just things were said that that were totally not true and impressions were being made. Now, most of you might be familiar with my story that happened in, in 2013 of October in that year and I have never taken the chance to really come out and to say what happened. Instead, I've just let whatever was said about me just run its course until eventually people stop talking about it. But thus far, it hasn't helped me anymore because still it is something that comes up every couple of months making it seem as if I was just a bad person that just wanted to run away for no reason like so no I'm not holding back anything at all and I'm just gonna go straight into it when I was a child I have seen and heard my stepdad do things to my mother that I know nobody would see as favorable and when when it it in 2013 when the situation when it came up that when my mother told me that she might be taking me to live overseas with her with my stepdad who was living there at the time I expressed to her that you know I don't want to because I just want to be doing school out here and I had music doing at the time so I said that you know yeah I just want to be staying and living with my grandparents like I have been since high school and so what happened is that um, my stepdad got into it and it then became a situation where he said that you know I don't have a choice I don't have any room in this to make a decision whether I stay or I leave and I became very uncomfortable with it and I went to a high school counselor and I said to her I've expressed to her that you know this is going on with me and I just need some advice I just need to know what can I do about it because I didn't necessarily want it at that time to come out and to say to her, well, you know, I know what happened between you and your fiance when I was a child. I didn't want to get into their relationship. And so she said to me, um, because I'm leaving high school now, I should probably go out and look for scholarships to go to tertiary education and I did that I found scholarships I said I would just continue in Jamaica from there I, I just had plans made and I expressed to her and she was okay with them and everything was fine she was agreeing with everything until in that October now when my stepdad came down from America to Jamaica to take us up and it was still being said that it now turned from a situation where I never had a choice to that I had to do it and when I I just told him myself that you know I don't want to be coming to to live with you in America it became a situation where he just said to me that you know I if it even means 
for him to have to quit his job to take me over there then then that's what's gonna have to be done no um, so it just became a very scary situation and I said I was going to take 24 hours away from home 48 hours away from home and I called my mom and I said to her you know I'm not coming back home until I'm able to hear that you know I will be able to stay hours passed it was in the middle of the night he started calling me and messaging me telling me that he would be placing me on another alert putting up posters with another guy that that I have been friends with that has been helping me with tutoring I won't even get to calling his name because this had nothing to do with him and they made up false stories they fabricated stories made it look as if I was just being somebody that wanted to be rebellious and it just became this long situation and they eventually went overseas and I'm still here now thankfully and here in Jamaica and um, I'm just I was just told I would have to be I would just have to support myself I would just have to whatever school fees I have to pay then I have to do them myself and they were serious about that because that's what's happening now and um, like I don't have anything more to say about this I, I just need to get the truth out um, like I was saying two two girls were supposed to go overseas one stayed back well that's me and another eventually after a couple months came back down I don't know why and I'm not going to even question I'm going to leave you to question that and it's just that thankfully things have been going good for me but apart from the fact that you know things are still being said and I'm sorry I never come out and said something from before but now you have the full story and hopefully my, my 19th year and onwards would be better for me and hopefully I, I just won't have to hear about it again and just share this video um, let it reach as much people that knew about this as possible because quite frankly I just want I just want to live a happy peaceful life and thank you for everybody that's been supporting me